my turn, and I went – I went in the productivity direction as well, and and Gina, Brian, Uh-oh. I'm gonna I'm gonna blow your minds with this app. You ready for this? Oh, um, boy. The app that I found, uh, which I think is very interesting, is called Koji C O G I. And um, hang on, don't show don't show anything more than the logo, Brian, because I want to I really want to sell this. Um, it's a it's a uh, productivity app that is focused around meetings, uh, specifically around capturing the important moments of a meeting, um, similar to Evernote. Um, it has photo support. It has text note support um, and a voice recorder. All right. Um, pretty cool. Doesn't seem much different than Evernote or from other, some other apps that are out there. So what makes Koji so different? And Gina, are you ready for this? I'm ready. Koji is a DVR for your meeting. All right. <laughs> so what does that mean? I started recording my little app thing with Koji as we were talking. And what it's doing is you can see it's slowly spinning. It is recording the audio from every that is happening right now in a kind of a recurring kind of loop. And then let's say you're in a meeting and Gina, you said something really, really insightful and really important that we don't want to absolutely don't want to miss. How many times have you been in that meeting where you're like, oh wait, what did you say? Write that down. How did you word that? With Koji, what you can just do is tap the app and it will rewind back 30 seconds and then you can save an audio recording from that point on to capture what happened in that meeting. How, how absolutely cool is that? <laughs> so right? wait, 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 wait. So you're recording. So you, I'm recording. You say, I want to replay what happened 30 seconds ago. It's 30 seconds back. Yep. It's 30 second replay for life. And now what's cool? So here, so let's go. I'll show you. I'll show you the app here, Brian. Take it. So what I can do here, I'm going to stop it right here so we can see it. All right. In the settings, you can actually change it from. 5, 15, 30, or 45 seconds. So if you really want to make sure you don't miss anything, you can set it to be 45 seconds. I had it set for 30 seconds because I felt like that was the right amount of time to react to. Um, that's really the only setting that you have to make. And then once you do it, what you can do is you can say start a new session. And here it's just going through. And you just you just set this on your on the desk as you're in the meeting, you're talking. And let's say somebody goes up and writes something on the whiteboard and you're like, oh, wait, I want to get a, I want to get a picture of that. So you can go take a picture of it and you can say, okay, great, I got that picture. Um, cool. And then uh, let's say you're like, okay, I, I don't want to miss this. So let me take some notes here and you can, you can type in some notes, you know, you just standard kind of text, text editor. Um, but then, you know, the key moment of the meeting happened and, and the key moment of, of knowledge and, and Gina, you came up with something amazing and we would just want to get the wording absolutely correct. Um, you just tap it and it will go back and you go back and say, you get that. And then in the review tab here, it will show you what you've kept track of. And so I for see. here, I was recording AAA 148, and I got six minutes of it. And so if I hit play there, it shows me the images, but then also... ...with Koji as we were talking. And what it's doing is you can see it's slowly spinning. It is recording the audio from every... That is happening right now in a kind of a recurring kind of loop. Huh? Then, wow, I cannot I talk. See. That's... No, that... No. I know you're doing great. So, so you're in a meeting. Someone says something cool. You tap to highlight, and it bookmarks that thirty seconds of of, of exactly I, in the review. And then later on, when you go back to review, oh, that's that's really cool. Yeah, that's really cool. All right, you've delivered, Ron. You, so you're it, talking it, off this app. Uh, but I get it. It is that's a cool. DVR for your meetings. How cool is that? That's so- I just I just wish I wish that it was called Corgi, and then there could be like a little dog that like well goes through your yeah. Well, I guess I guess they're going with some sort of co- oh. you know cognitive Koji. Like, I don't know, C-O-G-I. Uh, okay, okay, um, okay. It's totally free in the App Store. So, Brian, if you want to pull back up the uh, the Google Play Store, you can see the page there. It's totally free. Um, you said Corgi, right? It's a, no, no, a Koji. Koji, <laughs> oh, not Koji. Corgi. Oh, I see. Sorry. I see. There, we, oh, there go. we go. Do you have a Corgi, Brian, by the way? I have a Corgi. You have a Corgi, have a Corgi or whatever the heck it's called? <laughs> yeah. What are the odds that you have the dog that we're making the joke about? <laughs> That's amazing. my buddy. That's my, that's, my, that's my Corgi or Kogi. Co- Kogi, <laughs> whatever. My Kogi Corgi. So anyway, so it's called Kogi or Koji or whatever. Um, it's not like the taco or burrito truck in, in uh, L.A. Um, but yeah, so it's, I mean, it works on, it works on my phone. Super easy. Um, you know, admittedly you have to go to a lot of meetings. You got to be in the color of a business environment, but I cannot, te- I cannot tell you 
how many times I've been in a meeting where we're like coming up with copy and we're coming up with that kind of stuff and somebody says something and they're like, wait, how did you word that? How did you phrase it? This yeah. now lets you not miss those moments. Um, somebody in the chat room, uh, Dylan in the chat room is saying, you know, uh, recording lectures. There's uh, applications within education. You know, get the key moment from a lecture. You absolutely can do that. This is not your, um, if you're using it for your own use, it's, it's totally okay to record that and use it. I think, I'm not a lawyer. But um, really great applications to be able to capture those key moments that happen and not miss out on anything. So uh, Koji, totally free in the App Store. And uh, I don't want to. I don't want to be too cocky and say I, I already this this one's in the bag. But I got a good feeling about it. Oh man! Wow. Wait, let me ask you. So so uh, can you can you export those highlights to MP3? Like how to eat, or or the review tab is just to listen to it back. Yeah. You, the the thing is, is that you just have to listen to it back, and then here here you so you can see we can take my um take my over the shoulder cam. Mm -hmm. So when you play it through, so this is their kind of demo one. I love mm -hmm. that. So what they've got is they've got um, as each session goes on, every time you tapped it, there's different sections. So you can jump to the different highlights that happen. Um, and then you can see the waveform so you can jump to a particular moment. But it doesn't look like as of right now you can export it. Maybe, you know, if we give them that feedback, maybe that's something that, that they can provide. But it, and the key thing to note is that it's not – um, recording the entire thing. It's not going to save the entire meeting. It's only going to save the sections that you highlighted to say, yes, I want that section. Um, gotcha. So that's something to be to, to get used to. But either way, the power of that is just amazing. So, yeah, um, no, that's really cool. It's really yeah. useful. Right. So the idea is that you capture then, you know, whatever, in writing or however. Yep. Uh, the, the point is that you capture the only the audio you want. Right. And then do, do with it what you want once, right. once you review it. I I'm like being it. corrected in the chat room, by the way, that in the state of California, all parties need to agree ahead of time to the recording. So if you go to a meeting, be like, oh, I'm going to capture the meeting so we don't miss anything. Is that OK with everyone? Get everyone to say OK. Probably a good thing to do in any state just to be safe. But uh, yeah. as now the yeah, chat room is lecturing us on two party consent law. So I love the chat room. <laughs> probably so. a good thing to do as a human. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the state of being human. So. Um, so, yeah. So we've got. Koji, Basecamp, and Final Fantasy VI. As we mentioned, our friends at Straw Poll are having a little difficulty with their poll system this week, so we're, we're trying something different. Um, if you go to AAAPoll.com slash 148, you can get this nifty Google Forms poll that Brian and Chad whipped up before the show. Um, go vote and tell everyone what you think. Um, I don't know if we can see the responses. <laughs> uh, that's... <laughs> Let's see. How yeah, you is. can you, is it preview p previous responses. Oh yeah. yeah, there we go. Yeah, so there we go. So so far, it's not wow, it's not real time. Off to a hot start. But so far, Koji is uh, Koji's winning. So uh, there we go. Mm. Uh, Final Fantasy and Base Camp are are in are, are trailing. So there you go. Uh, wow, nine the, the, the sixteen dollar game is is beating Base Camp. That's a, come on, come on. Well, the thing about Base Camp, when I saw you put in Base Camp, I was like, ah, Gina. But um, it's really specific. You got to already be on yeah. Basecamp and be using it. That's the challenge. No, it's true. It's true. Yeah, it's true. So That's true. anyway, all right. So go to triple slash one forty eight and let your voice be heard, and we'll find out next week if my cockiness uh, comes through and everyone agrees with me how great uh, Koji is. Um, and hopefully Straw Poll will be back next week. We we uh, give them our sympathies and their server difficulties that they're having right now. Um, all right, cool. Well, that's the show.